What's up, what's up? It's another amazing year of Rhythm Unplugged here on the carpet, and you know how we like to do it. We have amazing lineups for you guys because this is the first day of Fly Time Music Festival, and we have three days to go, or two days to go because this is the first. I'm gonna give it you guys hot, hot heart. Today, I am going to be doing a little game. I'm gonna be playing a little game with the guests and with some of your favorite celebrities. I will be playing the devil's basket. But instead of picking from the basket, they'll literally be, you know, picking numbers from my phone and we'll be asking fun questions. And I can't wait, you know, to get in this groove. Stick around, guys. This is Fly Time TV. This is Fly Time Music Festival. Rhythm of Pog, Got You Locked 2018. And my name is Oluchi. How are you doing? I'm, I'm so excited. I'm starstruck. <laughs> But I'm so excited. I can't. The lineup is insane today. Okay. So we're talking about the lineup before you came here. No, we're gonna. You have not got your own. No. What? Two of you are answering it. All right. Talking about the lineup. So we have amazing acts tonight, and just perhaps you get stuck with one artist on the headlining out on the headlining list for a whole year. You got to listen to just one person. No other person. Who would that person be? Wow, I see why you didn't answer it. You are going to answer um, your own. <laughs> one whole year, the band. It has to be. Oh it my has God! To be. It like has to be. The Coco must. I mean, I don't have oh, a. What are you doing? What are you doing? The Coco. Okay. <laughs> this is the Coco move. It's the Coco move. It's the Coco move. I did it today, and my colleagues were like, "What am I doing?" I'm like, "I'm just doing this." Head and Coco. No voice. Oh. Coco sign. Just that's it. That's all. Okay. How about you, bro? I know you love yourself, but it can't be you. It can't be oh, you. Oh my God! Listen to me. Oh yeah. Yes. Oh, yeah. The band. The band. Get it. The Coco Master. Get it. Don't you ever. It's the band. Uh -huh. uh -huh. uh -huh. Okay, guys, you know how it always gets when you have one of the funniest people in Nigeria, in Africa, in the world standing right beside you. I've, I've literally been, you know, influenced right now. Yeah. I don't know what's happening. Something. How are you doing, sir? I'm great. I'm great. I'm Allow great. me to say Uncle Sir. Good evening. Sir. <laughs> Uncle Sir. Uncle Sir. <laughs> How's it doing? Uncle Sir. I'm great. I'm great. I'm great. So, you look like you're ready to come party tonight. Yes. Yes. I'm here to have fun. All the fun. Okay. All the fun. All that's right. what we're here for. Okay. So that's, that's what we expect. Okay. So, who are you looking forward to seeing out, out of the headlining act? Who are you looking I, think, I think I'm just here to see everybody. Everybody. I know you, you see everybody. No, yeah, no, truly, because if you make the list, it means you're exceptional. Okay. If you're not exceptional, you won't be on the list. Okay, so. Let's just say for instance now, in this world, you get stuck with one of these artists for one whole year to listen to their music one whole year, no other artist, one person. Who would that be? No, you get tired. No, don't no, let me put. That's what I'm don't, don't box if, me. Don't, if don't box me. In a world, like, like, don't box no, me. No, like I'm saying, if it, it's not like they'll do it to you, but if in a world you find yourself stuck here. Yeah. One person. One person. Who would, that, who would you listen to for one year? Maybe DJ Neptune because he will play everybody's song. <laughs> guys, come. Guys, DJ come. Neptune will play everyone's yes, song. Come. You just, you just, you just scammed the whole thing. Wow. I know there are a lot of headliners today. Who are you looking forward to? Um, funny enough, I can be see Duncan Mighty Ooh. and Nicole M.I. Ooh, who, three people. Yeah, yeah okay. Them, I, I, call me old school, but I mean, that's. Yeah, I mean, who doesn't like a classic, you yeah. know, all the good songs and the good vibes. Yeah. But if you got stuck with one of those artists for a whole year, to so listen to just that one person's music for a whole year, which artist would you go for? It has to be Duncan Mighty Akonuchi. You know, his sound gets to me. So you listen to one year? Yeah, you know, because the song is, is deep, you know, it's got meaning, and I can connect to the vibe, basically, yeah. I feel like, you know, this, you're interviewing someone, you're just an inspirational thing, you're like, ah, Don't you have to me. marry in your He's, family. He's just hand God. Don't count. Oh, nice. Okay. Real quick before you go, I'm playing this little game. I like to call it Devil's Basket. Okay. But this time, it's like an angel's basket because we have only good things on the list. Okay. You know? So, but there's no basket to pick from. But you get to pick from number one to 40. So, which one are you going for? 40. Uh-uh. Just went down, 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 bam. 40. Okay. If you were held at gunpoint and told that if you didn't impress them with your voice, you would be killed, what song would you sing? I would sing Duncan Mighty, Akonuche. Sing it. What Akonuche, what a man with a mighty. 
when they mind tea. Well, that could not tea, but I don't want to mind tea. Then I, the beat, I don't have the beat, but, but I have the, the chorus. Well, I'll give you the chorus. This is a mind tea, mind tea, mind tea, mind tea. Well, that could not tea, but I don't want to mind tea. That's the song. That is. He, just, he kept saying it over and over, he, he now finished. I was going to back you, but my song is going to die. Even him, no get back up for the song. Yes, he does. He, One he was back up less. All right. Yeah. Thank you so much. I know that you have amazing songs and you will probably want to listen to yourself over and over again. Yes. But if you had that one person that you had to listen to for a whole year, you couldn't listen to any other artist, just one artist for the entire year, for one year, which of these headliners would be your choice for a whole okay, year? You mean for the year? Like yes, people that are performing today, uh, everybody performing today, you had just one person to pick for a whole year. You're stuck with that person. Burner Boy. Ah, Burner Boy. I'd say Burner, Burner. Why Burner though? Uh, Burner is unique, his style is unique, different. And it's own way, man. It's just in his lane, nobody to test them. Uh -uh. <laughs> nobody, it's like on a separate I level, you know? I swear down. I'm playing this little game. Okay. I like to call it Devil's Basket. Oh. But there's no basket. That sounds familiar. That's like, is that a game from boarding school? Yes. I remember it. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> so you get to, you know, pick papers and all that. Oh, yeah. But this and then time, it's all like this. Yeah. Okay, okay. But this time, it's not really nasty dares. Okay. And you That's get what a, you say. Oh, yeah. It's but not. But you get to pick your numbers 1 to 40. Okay. And then we, you know, let it out okay. of the bag. No. Ooh, no peeking. <laughs> Okay, tell me. I pick a number? Yes. Uh, 28. Hi. 28, 28. Okay. So how soon did you re Are you in love? Do you have a partner? No, love is overrated. Don't do it. Oh, wow. <laughs> that's, that, that's scary. Don't do it. Okay. So since we're not doing love, you got to pick another number. Oh, really? Yes. Because it's a love question. That's my answer now. No, it's for the people doing love. Okay. Now we have to pick a number, number that has not a 17. Number. 17 year old today, so I'm nervous. Is hot dog a sandwich? No. It's like you're thinking about it. I, you know, I have to think, but I feel like a sandwich has to have two separate pieces of bread, okay. not like a bun cut in half. Okay. So that's why I say no. Alright. Number two. Okay. Name three celebrities you most admire. Uh the video. Okay. Two face. Jesus. Daisy, yeah. okay, bro. <laughs> it's like your inspiration is set up. You already know what you're doing. Ah, uh, yeah, sure. Thirty-five. Thirty-five. Have I? I think. Okay, number thirty-five. I'm afraid. <laughs> so, all right, let's get it. What's the most imaginative insult you can come up with? Nigerians very come up with very creative insults, you know. Ah. But I'm not. You know, I'm not really. Uh, don't start it. Don't even start it. You better tell us. Ah. Tell us. I can't even think of what. I usually don't insult people. I just smile at them. You yeah. don't. If you don't insult people, you have to give us another, pick another question. Uh, right, let's 10. go with 20. Do I have 20? Do I have 20? What was your childhood nickname? I had plenty. I had magic school boss. I had tiger. I had coconut head. Hey, My head was really big when I was young. So they called your head magic they school boss? They called me headmaster. They called me the Uri. They call me oh god, head boy. Head. the head boy. Ah. Yeah, what else? But like I said, magic school boy. Somebody told me that I don't dream dreams, I dream movies. Are we ready? Who's going first? I'll choose for number two. For no, number two is gone. Number six for her. Six, let me see. Don't cheat. Don't okay, cheat. are we cheat? If animals were if animals could talk, which would be the rudest? <laughs> <laughs> Chase yeah. See what you have done. Which would be the rudest? Yes. Maybe um, a snake? No, maybe a lion. Would they be rude? I mean, they'll be proud. Because they're confident in pride, rude. What is the difference? <laughs> okay. They'll be rude. All right. Okay. How about you? Number nine. Nine. That's a good question. <laughs> <laughs> what is the most embarrassing thing you have ever worn? Nah. Uh -huh. well, I'm ready to uh, yeah, go. The most embarrassing thing. Yeah, I, 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 
Yeah, it makes me look older than my age. Yes. And I'm calling me Baba. I agree. And I have Papa to, I, have to, I have to be your homeboy. Boy. It's a sweet boy. It's a sweet boy. Even at 50 years, it's a boy. Oh my God. Pick a number, 1 to 40. Fu. They are taking two. Fu is gone. They are two. Uh. Uh. Okay, chill. Uh. Um. And okay, so give me two. Oh, uh, this one is so good. Well, number three says, What accomplishments are you most proud of? Um, lifting the Olympic torch. Oh, good. Yeah. Now, can you tell us? Representing about it? Africa, representing Nigeria, representing Africa, lifting the Olympic torch at the Olympics. Um, one of those that lifted, uh, we also had Kanu Anko, we had Funke Akindele, myself. And a host of others. I want to be like you when I grow up. Uh, really? Yes. I'm still young though. <laughs> I don't think he, I'm still a baby. <laughs> this is not grow up life. If this grow up life, I don't grin. It's too hard. <laughs> I don't want to be adults again. No worry. I've lost no it. Worry. No worry. Yeah, right. but, but that's it. Thank you so much for your time. Thank you.